CompTIA ITF plus Complete Training Course. Exam Objective 6.6, Explain Common Uses of Encryption. Plain Text versus Cipher Text. Understanding the distinction between plain text and cipher text is the very first step when venturing into the expansive realm of encryption and its study, termed cryptography. So let's take that first step and begin with a quick look into plain text. Picture yourself jotting down a message to a friend. This message, in its original, readable form, is what we term as plain text. In the realm of IT, plain text is any data or text that hasn't undergone encryption, making it readable by both humans and computers. But here's where the plot thickens. When we aim to safeguard our data or message, especially in the digital domain, we resort to encryption. This encrypted form of our plain text is what we refer to as cipher text. Think of cipher text as a coded message. To the untrained eye, it appears as mere gibberish. This encryption ensures our data's confidentiality, shielding it from unwanted attention. To reiterate and further define this concept, plain text is data presented in a format that is immediately understandable and accessible. It's in its most basic, unaltered state, free from any form of encryption or coding. This means that there are no protective layers or barriers concealing its content. Whether it's a simple message, a document, or any other form of data, if it's in plain text, it retains its original clarity and meaning. Anyone who comes across or accesses this data, be it a human or a computer, can easily read and interpret its contents. In essence, plain text is like an open book, transparent and straightforward, waiting to be read by anyone who stumbles upon it. As for cipher text, it stands in stark contrast to plain text. It is the result of taking understandable, clear data and transforming it into a format that appears random and nonsensical at first glance. This transformation is achieved through a process called encryption, which employs specific mathematical algorithms to jumble the original data. These algorithms rearrange the data in such a way that its original meaning becomes obscured. The primary purpose of this scrambling is to protect the data's integrity and confidentiality. Without the correct decryption key or method, which acts as a sort of digital password or blueprint to reverse the encryption, the ciphertext remains a puzzling array of characters, numbers, and symbols. Only those possessing the right key can revert the ciphertext back to its original plain text form, making it a perfect mechanism to safeguard sensitive information from unauthorized eyes. In the vast digital landscape, where data breaches and cyber attacks are prevalent, ciphertext serves as a fortified shield, ensuring that even if data is intercepted, it remains indecipherable to those without the means to decrypt it. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.